Hey guys, my name is Paul and I wanna show you my project. But before that, I just wanna clarify that this is not a tutorial. I just wanna show you guys how far this technology can be developed. And this is my website, my project. This is cataract detection or cataract detector website that can detect any cataract area on your eyes before you using it you have to make sure your lights on your room is bright enough to make your face bright inside the camera so today I am using the help from my flashlight so the first thing to do is uh, prepare a good camera and make the light bright enough and just take the break the picture okay so this is the final picture that I get so the result is my photos and my eye this I in the right side is extracted from these photos and then there's a message that say there's no indication of cataract in both eyes in left eye and right eye so if you want to take, take the picture again just click back button and take another picture okay that is my website and how I made this what I'm using in it I'm using media pipe uh, basically it is a face mask technology I can show you the website because the website is updated recently so it, the website from media pipe is completely changed from the time i start to develop it so i just wanna show you how i do the code so i i, I won't share my code to you guys uh, remember this is not a tutorial i just wanna show how far this technology media pipe can develop so this is my I where's my idea came from this guy inspired me and I took some of code from here so the channel is AI feel which have title iris striking so basically this is a iris striking technology but I made a next step uh, advanced development to be able to use in cataract detection and blur up the split line so it will look a bit more smoother so then uh, now uh, again uh, instead of this is the code, you can R, view by yourself right. and some stuff here yourself. like as 470 same, same as my website my website can track my eye position both eyes and this is can be 28 landmarks so you can create a blender add-ons on that but, uh, this man just create a uh, eye tracking but I made uh, the, uh, the next step not just a eye tracking but it's a uh, cataract detection website and let me tell you about cataract so cataract basically uh, a condition that too much cloud in your lens of your eye so the eye is changed from the black or brown to white or gray so this is a dirty cloud that cover your, your eyes so basically this is 
maybe it's a cataract detection maybe it's a white area detection you can call it either way and besides uh, I using media pipe I use flash HTML to make it make the package of this website this website is not made by javascript or something framework library reno this is made using html and flash but remember this is not flash that you maybe know this is not flash api this is just flash template flash html you can find by yourself so flash template is a template of html that renders from python so basically i'm using a python and the html is showing you guys the results is this is so this is what you see is from html and i put the logic things on python and flash is like the bridge it's connect the python and the html and if you don't find this you can search it flash ginger or something because a lot of people call this ginger template Okay, I think that's enough. Uh, if you have a question, you can put your question in the commentary below, or you can. No, I'm not letting you guys have my contact because I I'm not sure yet. I can share you guys my code. I just share my result and I just wanna tell you guys that this technology can be developed, can be able to make a website like cataract detector or something, not just eye tracking like this. And you can maybe can develop it. On the other way, just not as cataract, but maybe the other thing. I just tell you guys if this technology can be used for many things. Okay, if, uh, if you have a question, just let me know in the comment. And if I want, if I want to share you guys a code in the future i will reply i will reply your comments okay okay so stay thank you see you soon